One of the most common heart procedures is called a coronary angioplasty. That's when a balloon opens up a heart artery and usually a stent is placed in there to keep it open. But that procedure is now being improved with technology borrowed from kidney stone blasters. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez has the details. In January, I got up to walk my dog and I got to the end of my driveway and I felt like a horse had kicked me in the chest. That heart pain led Barbara Coella to have, like more than a million Americans a year, a couple of stents put in a heart artery. But I was still having shortness of breath and I was still having, you know, like difficulty breathing, even with the chest, stents. And chest pain. Mm hmm. Yes. It was even getting in the way of hosting her Italian restaurant. But her heart blockages were heavily calcified, too hard for more angioplasty. That's when her doctor told her of a just approved procedure to open those hardened arteries. It's an ingenious adaptation of kidney lithotripsy, or stone blaster technology that's been around for decades. Dr. Harun Faraz still passes a thin wire through the hard calcified blockage in the heart artery. Then a special balloon emits a series of shock waves that gradually microfracture the calcified plaque without damaging the artery. Which is changing your vessel from being hard to flexible. And once you have opened the blockage, if the vessel is flexible, it allows the stent to be nicely put in so that the stent can do the job the way it is supposed to. Barbara actually went home the same day of the procedure and within a week. I feel so amazing. You would never know that I had any heart symptoms, procedures at all, nothing. I That's... can race up and down the steps. I can almost do a marathon. This technique called IVL could help as many as a third of angina patients with calcified plaque. It's also been approved for several years for use in other non-heart arteries with similar hard blockages. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. And Dr. Max does tell us that patients still need to have a stents put in. The IVL is what softens the artery enough to place those stents.